So sales, so you got the, the customer contact list, typically an internal type of thing. The deposit detail, that's usually gonna be an internal report. You're not usually gonna be generating that to provide to clients on a monthly basis. Estimate and progress billing, internal. Estimates by customer, internal, helping us facilitate our communication with our customers. Income by customer summary, you, you could do that external, but that's gonna be, well, and, but that's actually, that could be an external report, but that's a good one as we saw possibly to make a graph out of, although we made the graph and the pie charts out of the sales, the sales uh, by customer summary. So I think uh, that type of information you might add as an added touch over and above your normal kind of bookkeeping reports that you might be providing to somebody to give the pie charts because their sales lines are usually the ones that they're most interested in, right? And so, so then you got inventory and I'm not talking about like an audited financials, then we would have notes and whatnot to them. I'm just talking as a bookkeeper, given your bundle of reports possibly on a monthly basis. So inventory valuation summary, probably probably not something that's more of an internal report typically not something you're going to be providing on a monthly basis all the time payment methods internal physical inventory worksheet internal uh, product service list internal typically sales by customer and again this is one that you might make like an external pie chart or graph from because that could be a good visual same with the sales by product summary you could make that into a pie chart or a graph which could be a nice external touch because sales is usually the big line item that people want more detail on.